Barbie get the jeep? Take it easy, Kirby. I already got one. Jack. Wharton. Lene? Hey. Jack. Got one. Wharton again. Ah, Dad, I don't want to make you happy. Here you go, Kirby. Nelson. Uh, Holmes. to Roger. Out. Rough, huh? Yeah, we'll patrol on the left flank. Heard some firing come from the outpost. By the time we got there, they were getting clobbered. Better grab some rest. S2 reports a supply dump the other side of these hills. They want it knocked out. What about air? Haven't been able to spot it. I got a couple of replacements for you. Are they green? I didn't ask. just looked at him again. That grenade really tore him apart. <laughs> Take it easy. Take it easy. Sarge. I picked up one for you. Oh, well, you better tell you us to get some rest when moving out again. And uh, pick up some thermite grenades. All right. Hey, is that from home? Yeah, it's my kid brother. Hi, Chip. I know it's been a long time between letters, but while well, with this part-time job in school, well, I've been pretty busy. <laughs> hey, get me. You guys are fighting a war over there, and I'm telling you how tough civilian life is. Mom's fine, sends her love. She really misses you. Well, I don't want to sound too corny, but so do I. Hey, you remember Charlie Thompson? He was a year ahead of me in school. He got himself a medal over in the Pacific somewhere. <laughs> you know, you guys used to kick him out of the clubhouse all the time because he was so young. Yeah, there's, a, there's a lot of guys in now. Look, I, I guess I've stalled long enough, Chip. Uh, I'm going to tell you something, and please don't get mad. I'm not going to finish school. I've enlisted. Look, Mom signed the papers, but, but don't blame her. She didn't want to, but I talked her into it. Oh, that dumb kid. The bad news? Hey, morphine. Give me some morphine. I know what you must be thinking right now, Chip, but I just wanted to do it, so please try and understand. Hey, it's, it's been a long time since you've seen me, huh? You can't tell by the picture, but I'm almost as tall as you are. I'll bet I'll look pretty snappy in my uniform, huh? Look, as soon as I find out where I'm stationed, I'll write you and give you my new address. And, Chip, don't worry, huh? I'll be okay. You take care of yourself. And don't go finishing that war until us younger guys get over there. Hi, Kirby. My name is uh, Johnson. Uh, this here is Jim Hummel. Hey, what do you say? 
He was afraid you guys were going to end the war before we got here. <laughs> yeah, no chance of that. Saunders? Yeah. I'm Johnson. That's Hummel. Private Jim Hummel, Sergeant. Well, you might as well uh, relax. We'll be here for a little while. Sergeant, will we be going up to the front soon? You're on the front, Hummel. Texas in August. <laughs> Is that where you're from? No. I just trained there. Camp Walcott. Oh. You don't want a cup of bad coffee, do you? Never drank the stuff. Yeah, maybe I ought not to criticize it. Someday I might be old and weak myself. Hey, uh, you don't happen to have a can of that good foot powder, do you? No. Why? You find out soon enough. <laughs> I got my boots pretty well broken in. All right, all ready to go, are you? Oh, oh. Doctor. I saw a dead man before. Guess you get used to it. Is he a buddy of yours? Oh, I knew him. You never get used to it, Hummel. King two, Roger out. Saunders! I got a new report from S2. Their info puts the supply dump just about in here. They're not sure where. Looks like good cover all the way. Uh, Lieutenant, uh, no replacement, Hummel. What about him? Well, we might be better off if we didn't take him out on this one. What do you mean? Well, he's green. Things will to get hot out there. Saunders, you've been out with green men before. Besides, you're shorthanded. Better get going. Right. Doc. 
Doc. Okay, let's go. Keep going. And check that road near the side of the lake. drink too much of that. Could be a long day. I forgot. Water discipline. Been out here a long time, huh, Sarge? Since Omaha Beach. Omaha Beach. That's where Chuck got killed. Chuck was my older brother. Brother, huh? Must have been rough on your family, huh? Yeah. There's just Mom and Jimmy now. That's my kid brother. Mom took it real hard. See, uh, Chuck was about eight years older than me and worked ever since he was a kid and helped bring us up. Why did she let you enlist? She didn't want to. She didn't want to at first, anyway. I talked her into it. Told her I'd finish school when I got out. You know how mothers are. It's clean out there. All right, Cage, take him out. All right, let's go. Whoa. 
walk, walk, walk. Cage, I forgot what it's like to ride. When this thinking war's over, I'm gonna get me a job driving a cab. <laughs> I think that truck is headed for the supply dump? Maybe. Or it's coming from it. Hey, Sarge. Quiet. Hey, Sarge. If I can get close enough, maybe I can hear what they're saying. You understand German? Some. Had it in school. It's worth a try, ain't it, Sarge? Okay, you're on me. First, you stay here and cover us. Stay behind me and stay low. Right, sir. Remember it. Think anything out? Yeah. It's a, a building. It's down this road. It's over a hill in some kind of valley. Let's go back. Johnson, get rid of those bodies and hide that truck. You okay? Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah, why shouldn't I be? How should I know? I got one shot off in the Sarge sub my face down in the ditch and told me to stay there. Well, maybe he thought you were sticking your neck out a little bit too far. He probably were, too. Maybe. Let's move out. I 
keep your eyes open. If they heard those shots, they'll be laying for us. Kirby, take the point. you had it back there. Oh, I was okay. He didn't have to shove my face down that ditch. Well, sergeants are a strange breed, you know. I mean, I've had four of them in the last six months. Sometimes they're like that. They treat you like a china doll, wrap you up in a blanket, you know, so you'll be safe, like back there. Next time, he's going to set you up as target practice for those crowds. So don't worry about it. Forget it. Cage around me. How will you stay here to give us cover? From here? From here. Let's go. I told you to stay back there. 
I moved up, Sarge, because... When I give you an order, I want it followed. Oh, wait a minute, Sarge. Johnson got hit and he had me pinned down. He saved my neck back there. And nobody asked you, Kirby. I'm sick and tired of these green kids coming up here, getting their tails shot up before they even know what's going on. What about Johnson? He's dead. Go on, move out. Sarge, I'm sorry if I was wrong back there. But when I saw Kirby pinned down, I th thought it was the right thing to go and help him. If you want to stay alive, I'll do your thinking for you. any luck at all, you won't have to use that anymore today. If the Sarge has this way, I won't be using it, period. Was I wrong back there? Listen, as far as I'm concerned, you did just fine. Well, then why'd he jump all over me? Well, we had it rough lately. Lots of casualties. It's got to show up on him somewhere. Look, go along with it. Somebody wants to keep me out of this war, they got a customer. Well, I can do my own fighting just like everybody else. Well, nobody says you can't, Hummel. It's just like Kirby said, things have been a little rough lately. You just came in at a bad time, that's all. Maybe. I think he just doesn't like me. He's not all wrong. Yeah, I know. It's kind of like Sarge is trying to keep him out of war or something. Well, maybe he's just worried about him. Well, if he starts playing big brother to every new kid in the outfit, we're going to have to start worrying. You've been riding that kid a little bit too hard. It's for his own good. He hasn't been up here before. Well, yeah, but I saw him fight back there. Looks to me like he can handle himself pretty good. He's got to learn to follow orders. Well, he's a little confused. He... He thinks he's doing something wrong. He'll be all right, Doc. 
Don't worry about him. I saw them take a, a dirt road down around the hill. Okay, let's go. be rough with that half track. We're almost finished unloading. We'll wait to see if it pulls out with the truck. Stay here, keep your eye on it. <laughs> that came in with the half track. We'll wait till I've finished. See if it pulls out with him. If it does, that's eight, maybe ten men in a machine gun that's left. Oh, is that all? Hey. You're beginning to realize what I was talking about before, huh? V! V! Begin to get to you a little bit. You know what I wanted to be when I was a kid? Track star. <laughs> I better forget it. With this pair of nubs, I'd never get anywhere. Come on, Hummel, forget it. Just forget about it. You know what it is? He just doesn't trust me. That's not that. Just got a lot on his mind, that's all. That sergeant's a good guy, kid. It's just that... Do me a favor, will you, Kirby? Stop calling me kid. Thanks, sir. They're almost finished. How's Chris doing? Why? Well, you got a letter from him this morning. I just kind of wondered how he's getting along. He's okay. How old is he now? Seventeen. Sarge, is everything okay at home? What do you mean? Oh, Chris enlisted.
Well, he'd have to go pretty soon anyway. Oh, give me that, Doc. He's just a kid. He didn't even finish high school. Getting closer. Well, we gotta get a thermite grenade in. Cage, Kirby. Work your way down there. Split that fire. You wait five minutes, then you open up. I'll work my way around the other way, try to get behind the building and get a grenade in. Hey, let's go. Doc? You and I will stay here, and don't open up unless they spot me. Let me go with you and cover you. I said you stay here. Why? I can't do you any good from here. You do what I tell you. I got less chance of being spotted if I go alone. Why won't he let me go with him? What's he trying to do, be a hero? You haven't been up here long enough to know what a hero is. You better start learning to follow orders. Sure, I'll stay up here and play it safe like you. I was trained to be a soldier. So was I. Sorry, Doc, I didn't mean that. But I should be down there covering him, and you know it.
told you to stay back there. You can't do any good from here. Give me the grenades. I'll try to get one inside. They didn't see us come down here. I'll try to get around behind them like you were going to. You wouldn't get 20 feet. How do you know that? Sarge, it's worth a try. They're never going to get out of there. Well, maybe if we open up from here. One of them. One of them might be able to make it. That won't work, Sarge. They're pinned down. Good. I'm the only one left, and you know it. I can do it. Okay. I'll try to take it all at once. You... You keep low. If they spot you... You wait till I open up. Take off your cartridge belt. Leave your M1 here.
He'll be all right, Sarge. He just caught one in the shoulder. I made it okay, huh, Sarge? Yeah, you made it. Doc, give the kid a hand, huh? I'm okay, Sarge. I'm walking. Okay, soldier. Let's go. And Chip, don't worry, huh? I'll be okay. And you take care of yourself. <laughs>